You know, when, when I was growing up, you know, one of my favorite shows that used to come on television, it was made, you know, much much longer before I was born, but that you would always show it. And one of my one of my favorite shows was Batman. You know, and I'm not talking about the cartoon Batman. I'm not, I'm not talking about the, the Batman that you see on the movies nowadays. It's all gloomy and dark and depressing and, you know, I got all these gadgets. No, no, no. I'm talking about the old school Batman. The Batman and Robin show, you know, the one where Robin would say, Chuck and G, who's the fat Batman? It's the Joker. And the one, the Batman that had the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know about that. Where are my old school people? The back, I'm talking about the Batman that when they hit you, the sound that the punch made will flash before the spin. It will say smack, kapow, poof. I'm, I'm talking about that Batman. You know, the, but the most interesting part about that Batman, you know, I was a young kid and I didn't know no better. My, one of my favorite villains that they would fight was the Joker. And the Joker was all colorful and anime, animated, and he, he would have these traps set for Batman. And you know, I'm talking about he would have these big elaborate schemes set for him, and they would get all the they would strip all of the weapons from Batman, and they wouldn't have no bat suit. No, all they would have was just the bat suit. And, and, and but some kind of way, they always manage to escape. And me being the intuitive, the, the wanting to know the curious young man that I was, I wanted to know how did they possibly escape every single time. I never, I mean, the Joker would have, I'm talking about these elaborate traps and contusions and having all set for them. Some kind of way, they always managed to escape. And you know, as I begin to get older, I, I, I start learning about television. I start learning how things work in the production. And, and, and I understand now why they always escape. Right. Somebody say, why is? Why? Because it was written in the script for them to escape. Yeah, right. It was written in the script for, to the, right. for them to escape. I don't care how bad the scene was. Yeah. It really didn't matter how bad the scene I mean, you would take everything from them. But they always escape. Why? Because it was written in the script to escape. And you know what? The devil has set some traps for the people of God. He has, to, he has all these elaborate plans and he has fought your children, he fought your marriage, he fought your job, he fought your finances, and he don't understand how in the world you keep escaping. There's no way she coming back to work on Monday. There's no way he coming to church on Sunday. There's no time away. You keep coming back. You keep lifting your hands. You keep dancing. You keep shouting. You keep saying. He don't understand. He don't get it. He don't understand. How in the world does she keep coming back for more? She keep coming back and now she out there. She coming back. She coming back stronger. She's coming back wiser. She's coming back better than ever. And you don't understand why, how, how is we keep, how are they keep escaping? On, well, we can lift our hands today and say it because it's written in the script. What is the script? The script is the word of God. The script is the purpose of God for your life. The script is the will of God for your life. This is the script. You must stick to the script. I don't care how bad the scene may get. Because you know life can be like a movie. You have good scenes, you have bad scenes, you, you know, you have those victory scenes, and sometimes the good guys are winning, and then you have those sad scenes, and the only thing that will make it complete is if you had a symphony in the background playing some lonely music. Because it can be so so somber. But I don't care how bad the scene may get, how tragic the scene may get, you got to stick to the script. I don't care what it is. This is the script. You must have faith 